Mike Wagner was born in Waukegan, Illinois in 1949 to a working class family. Wagner attended Carmel Catholic High School in the neighboring town Mundelein, where he fought his way onto the football team, not actually earning a spot until his junior year. Over 200 kids went to the school, and 110 of that 200 tried out for the football team each year. He made his mark those two years playing for the team. After graduating in 67, he decided to attend Western Illinois University. Not at university on a scholarship, Wagner had to focus on grades and work in order to pay off tuition. After his freshman year, Wagner had an itch to continue his football career and decided to knock on the coach's office door, asking if they needed an extra player for the football team. At the time, the team didn't have much to its name, so Wagner was placed easily as a starting defensive end. He made such a mark on the team during that first year that he was asked to come back again the next spring. But Wagner refused the offer without a scholarship. When rejected, Wagner said he'd transfer to find that scholarship elsewhere, knowing he couldn't work and pay for tuition all while playing on the team. The coach couldn't bear to lose Wagner's talents, landing the passionate player a scholarship in another two years with the Leathernecks. Wagner's senior year, he suffered an injury that had him limping for the rest of the season, but he knew he had to push through to get a shot in the NFL draft. Wagner's perseverance and passion for the game paid off. He was selected by the Pittsburgh Steelers in the 11th round of the 1971 NFL Draft as a defensive safety. When Wagner joined the Steelers, there wasn't much to the team but a name. But during his time there, he helped build a legacy for the team. In 1975 and 1976, he led the Steelers as a Pro Bowl selection with 36 career interceptions and 12 fumble recoveries. The biggest accomplishment of his career was winning the 1974, 75, 78, and 79 Super Bowls. Before this impressive stint, the Steelers hadn't claimed one Super Bowl title to their name. During these four Super Bowls, Wagner recorded interceptions during two of them, proving his outstanding contribution to the winning team. After 10 exhilarating seasons with the Steelers, he retired in 1981, leaving a legacy in his wake. Wagner serves to this day still as defensive backs coach at Pine Ridgelands High School in Gibsonia, Pennsylvania. He also carved out time to receive his bachelor's degree in accounting and worked in the financial industry for a stretch of time. Every team Wagner touched seemed to be left in better shape than it was before he played. His contributions to football will be long remembered, and he will go down in history as a passionate, dedicated, and game-changing player. Thank you.